you can easily create this liquid text effect in CorelDRAW. In this video, I'll be showing you how to do that. I'll be teaching you step by step on how to create your text effect in CorelDRAW. Okay, first thing you just have to do, select your text tool so you can just have any text of your choice. So I just have this simple word goodbye. So I'll be having it as all capital letter outro. So you can just change it and select any font of your choice and you no, know, you're just good to go. So alright, so I'll be making use of this simple font right here. So you can just select any font of your choice. So once you're done, right click on the text and convert to curve and the short the shortcut key for this is Ctrl Q. So if you press Ctrl plus Q on your keyboard, so you are going to have it converted to curve already. Okay, so you can just select any font of your choice, but I'll be making use of black tower. Okay, so once you've converted it to curve, you will see nudges like this. So you can always adjust your nudge once you've converted it to curve. So once you converted it to curve, just know that you can edit the text or you can change make change of the text. Like you want to remove E or you want to adjust. So it has been converted to, to curve. And the, the only thing you just need to do is just that we have our shape too. So you can just select your shape too. And then select the part that you want to drag or that you want to adjust right here. So I'm going to select the down part and click on it and I will drag it down. So you can see something like this. So once I'm done with this, so I'll be making use of my smear tool to just do the liquid effect on the text. So just very simple like that. So you can click on your shape tool on the little triangle on the fly out on the fly out of the shape tool you will see a smear tool right there so you can see smear tool so once you click on smear tool and you can also adjust the radius you can adjust you can increase and you can reduce it based on the this your screen and the size you are trying to to achieve just very simple like that so once you select and drag on your test you're going to have something like this you just click and drag on your test the same thing if you click on this down part if you click on it and if you drag it i get to have something like this just very simple like this so you can always have the liquid text effect in few minutes or corridor just very simple and likewise also you can also change the effect so you can make use of smooth effects so if you if you choose any of these three icon and this upper part right here so you can you can see the the changes the effects so you can always change the radius also you can change it and if you change it to like 85 and you're yeah, making use of the smooth effect so you can have something like this just very simple and you can just play along with every of these uh these two right here so if you just select your smear tool if you click on shape tool on the fly out for shape tool you are going to see smear tool so you can just play along the smear tool and make use of any of these icons so you can just select and see how it goes so you can see something like this you can see it's like a wavy a wavy kind of effect so you can see like it's just dancing <laughs> just very simple effect you can just do on corridor i hope you enjoyed this video and i hope you find this video helpful please don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel for more videos like and drop your comment if you have any question or if you like if you have any topic you like me to treat and you can just drop the topic on this comment section button 